and welcome back to Come Geeksum. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe for all future content. We're going to be looking at something that Dominique Sky just keeps on posting. Again, this is going to be a video regarding her being chucked out of Comeacon earlier this year, which is actually really funny because that happened all the way back in April. And this, you know, we're, we're on the 21st of October here. And the way that she just keeps going on about it, even though it's been months since this has actually happened, she just cannot take the L and move on. We saw, so we all saw the video of when you know she was being chucked out. The actual guards there who worked for the Khmer Con, and they've done a really, really swell job. You know, they were there. They said, you know, told her everything that was going on. They've seen the messages on Twitter. They got evidence saying that she was going to go there and she was going to try and cause trouble. But again, in her usual little, little tiny voice, she then tried playing the victim. But they were harassing me. They were doxing me. They were doing this and that to me. I should be here because I'm a woman. And it didn't really work. And it was actually quite a good video. But she took that video down. And as I said yesterday, she has just been going around copyright striking all these videos. And it's really funny because she's like, oh, you're not going to use that. You're not going to show anyone this. Because the actual video shows her in a bad light. And I don't think she actually realised that until she posted it and everyone started talking about it. But with these here now, we're going to jump into a tweet that she sent on the 19th of this month, so two days ago. My mistake. It was not my video they used. Apparently it was a setup, and they used the guest pass as an excuse to confront me while recording it all. Completely planned from what it seems. Except they didn't count on me having a paid badge and the owner flailing over tweets. Well, first of all, with that, she's saying that these people intentionally went out of their way to get her. No, Dominique, you are not that special and you are not that important. You made threats via Twitter, which they saw, and when you decided to turn up, after being exposed earlier in the day at being a Doc's Comics with Monica, where everyone was like, hmm, that's a little bit strange, and obviously... You two were in the back of the Docs comics, and you were there, and it did look like you were planning something. But then all of a sudden, a couple of hours later, you turn up at Kamehacon. You have your filmographer there. I think it's your husband or your boyfriend. It doesn't really matter. But you had them there. They were filming. And then when these people came to you and said, Would you, you know, can you please leave? It's all documented, completely against what you were saying happened. You went out of your way saying they threw me out, they done this, they said that. But it was all recorded by yourself and a new, numerous other people. Then you put that video online, you didn't like it, so you took it down because people were like, well, it served you right. They were doing their job. They have tweets of you saying you were going to cause some kind of disturbance at the convention. To which you tried doing. But then again, you tried acting the little victim as you normally do, and it just didn't work for you this time. We're going to move on to another tweet that she has sent, and it was, funnier still was it was in response to this. We all know now I was biting my tongue and sitting on receipts because I was bullied into silence. So thank you, Ponyboner49, you had a hand in the creation of this. Hashtag Threadnought. And it's really, really funny because all these people, they say they got receipts, they got all the evidence going, but they haven't shown any of it. This is what these type of people do. They say they have evidence, but then when they can't produce it, they go on a blocking spree. This is exactly how Monica and everyone else does it. Because to be honest with you, I'm still waiting on all the receipts that Monica says that she has. Well, it's all well, it's meant to be all over because you're all, you still go on saying, yes, we've won this, we've done that, you know. All the cases have been dismissed, 17 of them have been gone, they've all been thrown out. Well, show us these receipts. Show us everything that you have promised us. If you come out with this, these receipts and the evidence that you claim you all have, you could stop everything that is going on. You could stop all this drama and you could potentially stop all of us talking about you and making people see what you really are. Because, again... 
if you have got receipts and you've got all this evidence, a smart person would have put it all out first and then you would have had a lot more support. But no, you say you got all of these receipts and evidence, but you're not showing it. And to a lot of people, myself included, when all you keep saying is, well, I have evidence, I have this, I have that, well, show it. To us, we're like, yeah, you haven't, you haven't got nothing. You are literally grasping at straws and you are just tugging everyone along. And that's what's happening with this. It's just like, come on, what is wrong with you all? But we're going to look at one last tweet that she said. And it's towards emotion. You know, someone on Twitter and on YouTube is an awesome dude. And this is what she's had to say. I hear emotions back to expressing his undying love for me. Y'all could be watching this or that. But instead, exposing me is what you've conditioned your little chicken nuggets to get hard to. Enjoy the angry group session. And it's really funny with that because she, again, she thinks she's this some type of goddess who she's like, everyone wants to do me. No. The way you have acted and the way you act towards people in real life and on social media, I'm really surprised that you still have fans. Because the way you have acted is absolutely disgusting, Dominique. And to be honest with you, again, I'm, I don't condone doxing of any kind, threats, none of it. I don't condone any of it. But Dominique, you really are not that special. And it's kind of sad that you think you are. And again, you, you know, putting the space between the H and is and his because people have been, you know, you know false flagging. It's not false flagging when you have been actually causing harassment towards people. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe, pass the video far and wide, hit that notification bell for future updates, and I'll see all you glorious people soon.